What motivates me? Being the strongest man on the ice. I'm P.K. Subban, and this is my workout. Mondays are my favorite days. I usually do chest and back in the morning, and then uh, in the afternoon, we do our conditioning phase on the field. It's one of my favorite days, I guess. You know, especially in the summertime when you're gonna put on that tight t-shirt, it's always nice to walk out of the gym with a little bump. Well, my, I'm Clarence Laylor, I'm a strength coach. Uh, my gym here is it's all about getting results. Um, I believe in getting athletes results, training, training them properly uh, in terms of to increase their performance. We don't babysit here. PK did a warm up in terms of just getting his body ready, getting loose, activation warm up he likes it, he does on the floor. Uh, then he finished, then he started to do some uh, what we call overhead uh, squats. We call it muscle snatch and overhead squat. So I really like that, opens up his hips, activates his upper back. We proceeded to um, warm, warm up to his working load. Today we got him up to 125 pound dumbbell. Our first set was 105 pounds for two, and then we just dropped off to get a pump. And we supersetted that with wide grip chin ups. We just use the same principle. And then we just flushed out some incline uh, dumbbell, 60 degree incline chest press, just to get an extra workout. And then we superset that with dumbbell rows. Training at least, you know, eight times a week, nine times a week. Um, for me, necessarily, as a defenseman, I gotta be able to move guys in front of the net. So I have to be strong enough to be able to move these guys around. So strength is a huge part of my game. We utilize carbs at the right times for PK, you know? So pretty much he only has carbs around his workouts and he has one cheat meal a week. One cheat meal, that's it, a week for PK. I'll go home and I'll have a steak, uh, you know, some vegetables. Um, usually I juice uh, vegetables also. So dinner, uh, either fish or chicken. Um, steak if I really feel like eating it twice. Uh, don't expect to see results in the first week or first two weeks, but if you stick with it for a couple months, I mean, uh, this summer I started training in May, it's August now, and you know, uh, you start to see the results, you know, July, mid-July, you know, a couple months into your training, and you just have to be persistent and consistent in your diet and your training, and once you do that, you'll see the results. <laughs>